So this is a look out at residence 4R. This is a three bed, two and a half bath. Am I right on that one? I'm pretty sure it's... Three bed, yes. Three mm -hmm. bed, 1504 square feet. And let's go in and have a look. I like the exterior on these a lot. Mm -hmm. So plan four, 1504 square feet. This is a three bed, two and a half bath. Look on the entrance. A little bit of a tile here. We'll get right into the garage. Ooh, oh, that's closet. The closet, I thought it was a garage. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Good sign. Okay. Here's kind of a view from the corner. I, there's a plant there, so I can't mm -hmm. back up anymore, but this is actually a good size kind of walk-in area. You can put it easily, that bench is a good good placement. And this one actually has a tandem garage, so if you're not mm -hmm. familiar with that, that is where you park right in front of each other. Mm -hmm. It is uh, longer and not as wide. Mm -hmm. And then let's have a look. That's that a lot is, of space. That, that is a lot of garage. I was, I was kind of afraid it was going to be very narrow. Yeah. We got their electrical panel right here, along with the inverter for the solar that's on the roof like that nook that nook is fantastic that's trash cans right the there trash cans or even on the back side of that wall yeah freezer something oh, yeah. you know a little upgrade freezer or you could do some uh, garage storage mm -hmm. yeah so yeah this, this is actually kind of interesting so yeah so the single door for your car you've got the renai tankless in the corner I'll mm -hmm. just kind of go back. It looks like if you pulled in, you'd have plenty of room for your doors. You know, like this is not bad. Uh -huh. The only thing is you just, you know, if you have to park one behind, you know, behind each other, uh -huh. uh, first in, first out, you know, yeah, 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 that kind of thing or. So, I mean, you know, there's a lot of room. There's, you kind of lose a little bit of space because of this little wall right here. Mm -hmm. um, but there's easily enough room for, for two cars in here. Mm -hmm. And you got the space on the side where you could just get out of your car and then walk into the home. Yeah. You're not, it doesn't, yeah. I don't think you'll be cramped unless you have a really big vehicle. Yeah. And uh, lots of light in here too. We've got a bunch of One, LED two, lights. At least three, yeah. at least four. Yeah. All right. Nice. Not too Great. bad. I wasn't sure. Pleasantly surprised. Mm -hmm. With tandem, you kind of really, you know, it always feels like it's going to be like super tight and narrow. Mm-hmm. All right. Not this one. This is a really nice carpet too. Yeah. You like these textured, uh, really like do. patterned. Yeah. They are mm -hmm. nice. Yeah. I imagine, uh, I guess my first concern was like, would stuff get in there in the little, in the little cuts? The and, and you know what I mean? But they did a nice job in this tile. And right off the second floor, you got a little half bath right here. And then you walk right into the main living area. And this is actually really nice. Yeah. This is, um, oh wow, I was not sure what to expect. My goodness, let me step back here. This is really beautiful, really beautiful. You got the kitchen tucked away in the corner, and that is a good, good sized kitchen. What do you think? I like it, lots of cows, a little bit different. I like, you know, there's something that, um. I kind of like about it being offset a little bit. Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> look at in this table. That's Plenty really of nice room. Table, huh? I mean, Plenty of room. That's, a, that's kind of interesting. Even though the table doesn't come with a house, it's really nice. <laughs> Here's the patio area. A very generous patio. A lot of room. You want to see if we can step out there? Or? Sure, let's do it. Heavy door. Yeah, Ooh. very heavy. Step out here. Yeah, got that post right there. We'll turn around and go back this way. And then you're looking over the side, you can kind of see the walkway. I just came kind of blown away by how many cabinets like there are. <laughs> there is a ton of storage here. Go into the kitchen. Let's have a look at this backsplash. This is interesting pattern. I don't know if I would personally choose it, but just seeing it 
like maybe in a yeah, book, but it actually texture. looks really nice. Yeah, it's nice. The designer, designer. Huge window. Look at this window, huh? Yeah. And again, they decided to use the tile as a sill, which is great because it's easy to clean. And as always, they used our mirror sink in here, really durable. Mowing fixtures. They did the uh, gray. Uh huh. That's nice. Yeah. The gray, the gray cabinet. Rather than white. white. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Do you mind putting a door? Oh, sure. Please. Thank you. Yeah, it's great. Lots of storage around this island. Even though this one doesn't have a pantry per se, but. Yeah, but with looks all Looks like you got a lot, a lot of storage, so I don't yeah. know if uh, you'll miss that. Yeah, I don't think you can go wrong with this much storage here. A view from looking into the kitchen. All kinds of LED lighting. And this is really, just really open feeling. A lot of windows. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go to the third level. You know, little finishes like what they did right here. Mm -hmm. A little add, trim. Yeah, a little, a little trim. trim piece, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. All right. And then that looks like it would be laundry. What do you think? Yep, there's a bin up top. Yeah. There you go, the GD stacked. Which is included in the everything included package. Nice bedroom, very good size, with a lot of light, big window. I am really liking the huge windows. Oh my God, yeah, it's no, nice. But the huge windows, the, the nice big window seals, mm -hmm. and then they've added in these narrow. Yeah, the little, you know? Yeah, it just adds a little bit more light. Mm -hmm. They actually like do really it. nice window treatments on this one, didn't they? Mm -hmm. I like those. And normally they don't really show those off much. It's a good size bedroom. You lose a little bit of space in this corner here. Yeah, I was gonna say a little bit of an odd. Yeah, there must be some sort of support. Kind of thing. Yeah, probably. Yeah. yeah. All right. And then let's go into. We got here a little linen closet. Huh. Thank you, Betty. Mm -hmm. Good size linen closet. You know, I never really showed off the hardware all that much. Mm -hmm. It's kind of that, what do you think it's a antique? I'm not sure. I think they call it like a oiled bronze yeah, or, yeah. or something like that. I know I've seen it before. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> antique bronze. Here is spare bath. Got that textured floor. And the single, single uh, vanity. So the storage right here. A really nice tile, actually. Mm -hmm. They did the gray and the white up here, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A little view of the vanity. And I'll step back. All right. And which one? This one? Sure. All right. Another bedroom. Yeah, I like these. I want to cover these. Nice bedroom. Yes. Very nice bedroom. You can kind of go around. Good size. I think this is probably a full bed, full size, standard. Yeah. I think you're right. Feels very open in here, especially with that corner. Yep. Like it that. does feel like you get a little extra. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what this master looks like. The owner suite. Mm -hmm. Looks nice. Mm-hmm. Go into the walk in closet. Good size walk in. Not huge, but definitely not no. bad. Lots of storage room. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm looking the, there. That's a king. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. They always put the most interesting light fixtures in, huh? They do. <laughs> <laughs> and then they got that kind of marble floor. This 
one doesn't look as shiny. It doesn't. I think I like it better. Yeah. I'm kind of more of a matte finish. Mm-hmm. The shiny always makes me think I'm going to slip and fall. Mm-hmm. I like this. Yeah. You're getting out of the shower and, you know, if you got wet feet and if it's <laughs> super slippery. <laughs> Then, yeah. You know, they didn't just jam that in there. There's like a little bit of room in there. So you're not, mm -hmm. it's not all super tight. Mm -hmm. Another view from in there. Not bad at all. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts on this one? You know, I think I may like this one better than six. Really? Yeah. That's interesting. That's real, real interesting. What, what is it about <laughs> this one versus six that you, uh, is it just a you main, know, is it the I second like, floor? Or is it, it is. It is. I like, I like this um, living area, the setup. It really I is. just like it. It's really, they did a good job. It makes, um, and that it kind of makes sense to me. Yeah. Yeah. Because, I mean, I know the big open concept, but I've never been a huge fan of where they do the, um, you know, kitchen, dining, right. living in that linear. Right. I like this. I yeah. like this. It's got some movement. Right. You know, that wall right there, um, you can probably put like a little shelf in there or something for mail mm -hmm. or even oh, a yeah. computer desk a if desk. you want it. Totally. Something like that. I like this. And just look at all these windows. I mean. Yeah. What do you think? You know, every single one of these, I'm expecting to be disappointed and I'm always impressed. And, yeah. and I don't know. I think they just got really good designers. Yeah. They know how to lay out these floor plans. They I include right. so many things. They show them with such good uh, upgrades yeah. and a good tile and just very thoughtful. And each one, I've noticed, each one has something unique about it. Exactly. You it's know true. what I mean? It's true. It's like this, you may have a tandem garage, right. Right. but right. you've got this. You exactly. Know? Exactly. They, they all kind of have a, a, a unique, you know, like plan five has the office downstairs. That's right. kind of cool head down to the first floor and I was actually expecting that tandem to garage to be kind of a disappointment I, I would say I was too because <laughs> yeah, you know I'm so used to being seeing like two side by side yep but honestly it's a very you know it's a good use of space it's quite spacious you got a ton of room for like maybe some shelves yeah you know let's get a little more look in there look. you know just just from opening the door mm -hmm. it's a little dark but it probably a I am not mad at that not at all yeah and if you don't mind swapping cars every once in a while or just sharing cars it'll work mm -hmm. yep cool yeah well thank you again guys this was uh plan 4r with 1504 square feet three bed and two and a half bath thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one thank you